What's up everybody, it's your boy Derek Taylor doing my unapologetic opinion reaction video right here on YouTube only. Before we jump into it, please get those likes up, subscribe, 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 trying to get those subs up to at least a thousand by the end of July and I can't get there without you. So if you like the content, please subscribe. It's gonna be a, pump, a bunch of these being pumped out. This reaction video comes from a subscriber on my IG channel my unapologetic opinion and uh haven't seen it but about to jump right on into it so let's get it popping so are you ready to be honest and tell me that you're cheating on me is that how we're going to start this off yeah that is it we haven't talked about it yet i didn't cheat on you i know that you did how do you know this because the girl you cheated with i paid her 50 bucks to hit on you why would you pay a girl to talk to me that's some crazy you are giving off horrible energy and it had a series of events leading up to that a series like of you events flirting with other girls you eyeing other girls who would i ever flirt with oh my gosh all the girls at your gym you're not at the gym so how can you say i'm flirting on with instagram them? i've seen it what do you mean you're over there liking all these girls instagram pictures your workout buddies with all these different girls at your gym and you're literally posting thirst traps like ad pics like oh insecure. like i'm a trainer I have a real. fitness Instagram. So when I see other people that have fitness okay, pages, so you're gonna it's like, called oh, building them up. Sexy girl, oh, whatever. You're so sexy, you're gonna like that? It's yeah. for work. It's innocent flirting and help me get clients to continue to make money. What is like respectful in a relationship? Like, Trusting the person guys. and not paying somebody to see if they would cheat. But it happened. Not true. You went on a date with this girl. It wasn't a date. She literally told me that you took her out to eat. No. <laughs> yeah, and you guys hooked up. You can't sit here and deny that. I am denying because it's not true. It, okay. Sure. She's a client, and after we were working out, we got food, which was across the street. That's where not we what walked. she told me. That's what I'm telling you. She told you. me you guys had sex. I'm telling you we didn't. So are you saying she's lying? I'm saying she's lying. Let's find out from her. Okay. Dang. Okay. Oh my God. Somebody's lying. Paula, oh. can you tell him what you told me? Oh, so what's this? I pretty much told her. Oh, they about that to. You took me to oh, this really FaceTime. fancy restaurant and afterwards we went back to my place and hooked up. And that he came on to you in the car and you guys are kissing. Yes. Yeah, see? Why Thanks. would you sit here and lie? I lied because So you weren't telling Wait. the truth? I didn't think that she deserved you, so I lied. We're oh my god. Clearly she doesn't value the faithful, amazing man that you are. I thought, you know, maybe I have a chance because... So you thought you had a chance with him, so you're trying to homewreck us so that you can be with him? Wow. Thanks. She lied to my face. And what have I been saying? All right, well, I'm sorry for doing that. and We can't go that far instead of talking to you about it. When I feel like someone's pulling away, I'll just pull away too. We were long distance, and I see you liking all Instagram girls' Yo, pictures, and you were not her. texting me as much, not calling me. I was working a lot, but that doesn't mean I was cheating on you. Play it itself. I'm really sorry. <sighs> so that's that, ladies and gentlemen. That's that. So, um, here's my points on this. One, she should have been communicating with him better than what the, the fuck that was. Two, he should have been communicating with her a little bit more. But maybe he felt that, yo, he didn't have to. She understand what he does. From what I get, for, get from this video, they don't live in the same space, same place, same area. Like it's a long distance relationship. So insecurity will be a little bit more higher than if it was two people that lived in the same space, same area, but, and they're young. Um, but on top of that, he did probably assume, but she did the most by getting, and I'm, I'm assuming that's a friend of hers because I can't imagine a woman having another random woman get out her man to see if he'll really take the bait or not. I assume, I'm assuming that that's her friend. And her friend was like, I'm going for it. And she played herself. She played herself and she probably wrecked her relationship because I know if that was me, I'm out. Yo, B, that's what you gotta get to. That's that's a resort, that's a resort you have to take instead of just asking me a question or coming to me with your concerns. To let me know what I need to do to ease your concerns and vice versa. Dudes be getting like that too sometimes, man. 
especially when their heart's in it. And then sometimes they suffer giving words, especially men open up to women, how they feeling and stuff. But hey man, we gotta learn how to do this. And this is a classic case of lack of communication, okay? Now these two young people, she's a little insecure and I get it, I totally get it. He, he's not in the same state. You see all this, same place I should say. You see him liking stuff. But knowing that he's a fitness trainer and stuff, that is kind of how they get their people. You know, that's how Instagram works. You make, you like people's stuff, they like your stuff, you get following and so on and so forth. Shoot, that's how it normally works. That's how I met my trainer. So I get it, I get it. But what I don't get is that they have to communicate better than what they have been. I hope these two young people can get it together and figure it out. But that's a whole other level of next, like, ish right there and his face was like i'm done but i hope he understand the role he played in it too i'm not gonna just get on her i hope he understand the role he plays in it too that he needs to be more communicative to her to let her know that yo i'm here because the same thing that attracted her to him is the same thing she knows that attract other women to him so he's gonna have to do a little bit more to secure her that they're good Okay, and she's gonna have to do a lot more to communicate how she's really feeling and not go get her friends. And that's the last point I'm gonna make on this one for you ladies. If you're in a relationship and your man is doing good and he's good to you and stuff like that, don't don't tell your girlfriends. Or I would say, don't tell them everything. Tell them just enough, but don't tell them everything because if they're in bad relationships or no relationships, and they hear how your man is good to you, and then let's say arguments like you start kind of complaining a little bit about him, right? They're gonna be like, oh, well, he don't appreciate him. And they may be plotting on your man because they are lonely or they in a bad relationship and they want a good man and you got one. So I'll just say, ladies, be careful what you tell your girlfriends. You don't have to tell them everything. Because, you know, sometimes jealousy breeds envy. And they might say you got a good thing and they want some of it too. Just be mindful of the information you give out there. But for this video, hey, she played herself with that. She played herself with that. That was just terrible. That was, that was terrible. Like, what? But, again, they're young. I hope they figure it out. You know... And keep it pushing. I mean, he's a handsome young man. She's a beautiful young woman. You know, if they don't work out, they will clearly find other people. But I hope this situation make them better people for those people. And on that note, I'm out, y'all. Peace. Like I said, like, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Get those likes up. I'm trying to get to 1,000 likes by the end of July. Please help a brother out. Also hit me up on my IG channel, Unapologetic Opinion, where I post videos on there as well. Not reaction videos, but I get my thoughts on certain topics. But until then, peace.